So, hello everyone. Today we will have a review of such warm woolen blouses. A look at the first one. This one is checkered, very tight, beautiful. I like it. Let's see how it sits on me. Next comes this very interesting soft black blouse. So hairy. Next comes this such a shortened knitted voluminous blouse. And there will also be a black blouse this heavy and long. Whether you prefer the sophistication of a heavy, long black blouse or the playful charm of a fluffy, each blouse brings its own unique blend of warmth, comfort, and style, ensuring you look and feel great throughout the colder months. So let's start with it. So I'm wearing the first sweater like this, a long knitted one, it's quite long, look like this. It looks like this from the front, from the side, from the back, and from the back. It's longer than my skirt, but I love this sweater very much when, for example, it's kind of cold. That's because, for example, with some kind of pants on top of some other clothes, it's warm because of its knitting. And then I have these buttons here, you know, like regular cheap sweaters. It's not very good, but they don't bother me as if for me they give such a charm, as if it was some kind of jacket, probably taken from my grandmother. It has a fairly tight knitting that nothing can be seen in the light, the minus of this is, let's say, the material from which it is made. It rolls up into pellets and, unfortunately, takes a long time you can't walk in it. And also, it has a silhouette that goes along your legs like this. It fits like this. I don't really like it, but I don't particularly like, uh, for example, fastening things on myself. So I like to walk more like this with my outerwear open. That's what I like. It's just somehow unpleasant. Here it goes. Look like this like a small noodle and everything is here and also there are these stripes of inserts on the sleeves and also at the bottom and here they go along the entire length. Smaller ones like these inserts it stretches a little but not by much so you need to look at what proportions you have in order to choose the right one. It has a fairly large and wide neckline if you fasten it and the fasteners themselves are quite tight so it won't unfasten while wearing if you are somehow active like this I like the sleeves it's quite big. You can also add some other sweaters for more insulation. The checkered woolen sweater is a charming blend of style and functionality. Its tight fit accentuates the silhouette while offering warmth and comfort. The classic checkered pattern adds a timeless appeal, making it suitable for various settings, from casual outings to more formal occasions. The woolen fabric feels soft against the skin, providing insulation without being too heavy. I particularly appreciate how well it sits on the body, enhancing my figure without feeling restrictive. The craftsmanship is evident in its neat stitching and durable material, ensuring longevity, however the snug fit may not appeal to everyone, as it leaves little room for layering thicker garments underneath. Overall, this sweater is a versatile addition to any winter wardrobe, combining classic elegance with practical warmth. So let's move on to the next sweater. So I'm wearing the next sweater. It's also knitted, but it's shorter. By the way, be sure to subscribe and click the bell. But I didn't quite get the size right, and that's why there are changes. Then the long part goes forward, then back, let's see. This is how it looks from the front. This is how it looks from the side. This is how it looks, it looks from the back. You see that it is so short, and most of it has gone here. Here it already has another knitting. It is quite large and varied. So here there are several styles of knitting, just like here on the sleeves with elastic bands like this, and also here along the edge that there are several of them here. There are already a lot of these button fasteners, well, as I said, these buttons are the cheapest. They are often attached to clothes, you can simply change them, buy some more expensive accessories that you like better. Well, also, as I said earlier, I really like this kind of fittings, um, I don't know, it has its own atmosphere. But I like how it's here, that the handles are also wide enough, so you can put on several blouses under it, or I wear it, for example, even in hot weather somewhere when night falls because her knitting is no longer tight and it's quite see-through. Look right here, I can put my nail here. Here are these holes and it's breathable. I really love it very much. I always wear it everywhere in summer weather. Because, for example, in the winter, I wouldn't really recommend it because it's short and we need to take care of our health and not freeze our kidneys off, so to speak. And then I really like how everything is done here. These hems are what they go, you know how, like this. With one single stripe here in a circle, we go around our neck like this. It's very nice. 
The soft black woolen sweater is a unique piece. It's plush and cozy, perfect for colder days, perfect for various occasions and effortlessly complementing different styles and outfits. The soft texture adds a luxurious feel, making it delightful to wear. It's designed with a shorter length, which adds a modern twist, yet it maintains warmth. The intricate knitting details like the varied patterns and elastic bands on the sleeves give it a distinct charm. I appreciate its versatility, suitable for both casual outings and relaxed evenings. The sweater is easy to style. I often pair it with jeans or layered over a dress. It's surprisingly breathable, keeping me comfortable without overheating, however, being black, it's prone to lint and pet hair, requiring frequent maintenance overall. It's a stylish and comfortable addition to any wardrobe, blending practicality with fashionable design. Well, let's move on to the next jacket. So I'm wearing the next blouse. She's already got it in advance. So let's say there are no buttons here. That's what it's just like. It just suits the smell. It's quite tight. You know, I bought it for wear at home because I also bought an additional top of the same material. She has such tight fitting sleeves, but the knitting is so fine that it's also a knitted sweater. So it stretches a little, but you have to choose carefully. In any case, it will be her size. Look, this is what it looks like from the front. This is what it looks like from the side. This is what it looks like from the back. This is what it looks like. It's also short, but it seems to me that for some cool summers, there are some kind of transitional moments of the seasons. It's perfect. I like that it's very soft and, and it doesn't even seem to electrify. I really like it. I like those kind of um, then things with peculiarities in tactility. I don't know, I like to feel comfort, some kind of warmth and get into some kind of childish atmosphere and it itself is also special, it's short. For me, it's not a minus that there are no buttons and it's quite small, for example, here on the shoulders and it also doesn't have any knitting features everywhere and here it's just one single fabric that can't be disassembled, let's say, into some fragments, well, except for the handles, of course. Here on the handles, it's nice and comfortable. It doesn't cut into it, that's why you can sleep in it peacefully. For example, that for me it performs this function. And here it is, let's say, the hair cover of this jacket. It doesn't fly around, everything's fine. Even though I'm pulling it doesn't fly around, everything is fine. The third sweater is a charming blend of style and comfort, crafted from high quality wool with a soft lining. It ensures warmth without compromising on style. The design features a checkered pattern, tight fit and beautiful details. It sits snugly, accentuating the silhouette, ideal for cooler seasons. The softness of the wool adds to its appeal, making it pleasant against the skin. It's versatile enough to be dressed up or down. Suitable for various occasions, I appreciate the thoughtful design, including the subtle elasticity that enhances the fit. Though shorter in length, it's practical for layering. I find it pairs well with high-waisted jeans or a skirt, offering a chic yet casual look. The checkered pattern adds a classic touch, requiring occasional maintenance overall. It's a cozy and stylish sweater, perfect for staying warm in style throughout the season. So let's move on to our last checkerboard sweater. So I'm wearing the last sweater. It's already such a medium size that it's not like the first one and not like the previous one, that it already completely covers your back. This is how it looks from the front, side and back. So your back is completely covered. You can probably walk in it just like in the summer in some cooler periods and in winter because her sleeves are quite wide and you can wear some kind of jacket underneath. For example, oh, like a turtleneck. And here it comes. Look at these white elastic inserts. It is a little different in shade with squares and it, I don't know. It's milky. It's a shade of ivory. Actually, it's a bit of a minus because I'm not a very tidy person and I often don't know how it contaminates things. I spill it on myself and so on, I don't know. I end up in some ridiculous situations and unfortunately my sleeves often get dirty very quickly on such things. So I like to wear some kind of black clothes more. There are fewer problems with them than with such white ones. The material is also quite pleasant, but there are some problems such as the formation of pilling on it as well, I don't know what's wrong. It wakes up a little, but it's not as obvious as it was with the first sweater. That's the fact that it will last you quite a long time. It also has all the white inserts. It goes around the back of our neck. Its oversized silhouette ensures ample warmth and comfort, 
while the heart-shaped pattern adds a whimsical charm. But she already has these. Here are the white milky buttons. By the way, they are sewn crookedly. Look somehow strange. Write in the comments if it seems strange to you somehow, or is it just like that for me? Here too, everything is well made. All these at the hole, so I recommend it to you. The last sweater is a substantial piece perfect for colder weather, featuring a dense knit and a longer, oversized silhouette. It exudes a sense of coziness and warmth. The intricate design includes a heart-shaped pattern on the front, adding a whimsical touch. It's crafted from high-quality wool, which feels luxurious and robust, ideal for harsh winters. The sleeves are voluminous, providing ample room for layering. However, this also limits mobility for more active movements. The chic bow detail at the back enhances its elegance. Though the weight might be a concern for some, it contributes to its plush feel of overall. It's a statement piece that combines functionality with style, suitable for special occasions or when you want to make a bold fashion statement. While it may not be the most practical for everyday wear due to its weight, it's undoubtedly a standout in terms of design and craftsmanship, a must-have for those looking to stay warm without sacrificing style. Well, what right in the comments which jacket did you like the most? Subscribe, like, and bye-bye everyone.